Hey vlog community, it is Nika and I'm back with another video. So in this video, I am going to be telling you guys what I did wrong with one of my vlogs. And I guess I didn't necessarily ruin my vlog, um, but it did weaken it. And anyways, I was picking, y'all, I admit it, this was probably a month ago, a month to two months ago that I was picking at my vlog. And let me show you guys. So I gotta find it. It's in the back here, but this is it. And you can kind of see where it's more fluffy. So it's not as, you know, tight as the rest of my lock. So it's, it's, it's fluffy. I weakened it and you know, there's nothing I can really do except, um, just try to crochet it. So I, I went on Amazon and I got a crochet needle. I don't really even know how to do this y'all. So bear with me, but I got an Amazon package. And then what I also did was I finally invested in some silk. Um, pillowcases. So this was off of Amazon and they are, there's different colors. So I just got a light pink because my room is pink and my headboard is pink and I just wanted it to, to somewhat match. But I went ahead and just got these because the silk y'all, it'll save you from wind. And they're just, they're soft. These are soft because I do have cotton pillowcases. But I wear bonnets and stuff, but still having, oh, it's only one here. Oh, they played me. I thought that there were supposed to be two. So apparently I only bought one. I'm going to have to try to figure that out because this was supposed to have two in it. Huh. All right. I don't know. I'll figure it out later. But here are the cro crochet needles and I think I paid less than eight bucks for these online. It looks like there's two different ones. So I'm going to use this one. So again, I don't know what I'm doing. So this is it. It's just the bottom too. So let's see. Oh Lord, I'm scared. I don't know what I'm doing. But I did watch another YouTube video and try to get a little bit of knowledge before I did this. But yeah, I guess I just kind of need to work with it. And they say don't force it to come out. Just let it, you know not up but don't be like me y'all just get the silk pillowcase wear your bonnet don't pick at it if you can help it but i know some of us we just be wanting that stuff out so say no to this say no to this use this on your eyebrows use it everywhere but your hair if you can help it okay <laughs> so yeah, because otherwise you are going to be dealing with weakened locks. And I'm glad I only did it with the one. I only did it with one. I think this is the one. It already feels tighter, though. Like, it really already does. So I'm just working with it, y'all. But did anybody else do this? Did anybody else tweeze their lock and it weakened and got, like, kind of fat? Because that's exactly, you know, what we're not supposed to be doing. But it's okay to be honest, you know. That's why we learn from our mistakes and... Just go with it and then, you know, preventative, you know, preventative. So that looks better already. Okay, hold on. Just down so y'all can see. So, yeah. That was the one. Yeah. So, looks better already. But, yeah, you guys, just try your best to just cover your locks. Don't, you know, pick at them if, if you can help it. And... I, sometimes I'll be in the bathroom and I'll just be looking for lint that's even sitting on top and I'll hurry up and try to grab it out. But you don't want to be picking at your locks. Otherwise, you're going to have problems in the long run. So I, I learned my lesson. I do not want to weaken any more of my locks. And, you know, I don't know if some people do pick at them and then just keep doing this method. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, that's my video, you guys. I wanted to just keep it quick and short for you guys and just show you guys um, just me fixing my, my my lock and hopefully I don't have any problems in the future with lint but you can dye your locks um, to cover up lint if you cannot get it out and so um, it's not really a big deal like I don't I don't have tons of lint um, because again I try to like if I see anything I just try to get it out while it's sitting on top and just also just like I said pillowcases silk pillowcases wrapping your hair with silk or a bonnet just to keep it safe um, even sometimes our clothes it'll rub off on our hair and like I said during the day or just even when I just feel like it, I'll just go through my locks and just kind of like, oh, there's something there and just 
kind of get it off of the surface, if that makes sense. So thank you guys. Um, if you are new to this channel, um, please subscribe. And if you are not new and you've seen my other videos, welcome back. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Helps me a lot um, to get more subscribers and follow my journey. I want to stay connected with you all. So yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys have done what I did and picked out your lock and now you have this fat part because that's how my lock was looking. The rest of my locks, they're all tight and you know, but that one, it was getting on my nerves looking at it. So it's all fixed now. I think hopefully I won't have any issues in the long run with it. And it was at the bottom. So I didn't really mess with it at the, at the root. Thankfully, there, but there was just so much lint. Oh my goodness. It was compacted. So I had to, and I think just because it sits on the back, you know, of the neck and the collar, and that's where all the lint kind of sometimes goes. So just being more mindful. But this is my, my locks today. They look really good. I, I'm done with dye for a while, y'all. Like I, I did recently um, color them black, but even coloring your locks can weaken them, damage them. And you just really want these roots to be strong. I mean, not these roots, the ends and the roots, of course, to be strong. And you don't want to deal with them breaking off and, you know, losing length and all that stuff. So, and as you can see, I'm keeping my hair down because like I said, I was thinning on this side and this is actually already starting to look better because this was really thinning out. And then even, this side is taking a little longer, but as you guys can see, it's, you know, from tight ponytails. So don't do the tight ponytails. Keep it loose. Keep it light. And just remember to take care of your locks and they'll take care of you. All right. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.